Hello welcome guys, today in this video I will give you 10 awesome tips and tricks. That will make you become more confident while playing PUBG Mobile. In this video, I have included some of the best tips you can use to immediately become a better player. Many of these tips require nothing more than a bit of common sense. And if you remember to use all of these tips whilst playing, you'll immediately be far better than many other players. Always wear a helmet. In PUBG, your helmet will fall off if it takes too much damage. You should immediately try to find another one if this happens. Losing your helmet will make you extra vulnerable to damage. Especially from snipers. If you find a level 2 helmet, you'll be safe from car 98k headshots, so keep an eye out. Use third person to your advantage. Third person can be used to get a view of the surrounding area without exposing yourself. You can see how you can use the third person camera to look over slopes and hills without being spotted by players on the other side. Another great example of using the third person camera to your advantage would be to use it to look over walls or around trees whilst still remaining in cover. M. Use bandages, not medkits, when you have time. If you're not in a firefight, you should use excess bandages instead of your medkits or first aid kits. Bandages take longer to heal you up. And you must use multiple bandages, but by using them whilst out of combat, you're making sure that your most useful meds are available to you when you most need them. Use stairs as a good camping spot. On the flip side, if you can get into an empty building with a flight of stairs, you can also use it as a great camping spot. Stairs can be a great spot for campers and a very dangerous spot for those clearing out a building. Use stairs as a good camping. Use stairs as a good camping spot. On the flip side, if you can get into an empty building with a flight of stairs, you can also use it as a great camping spot. Stairs can be a great spot for campers and a very dangerous spot for those clearing out a building. Don't kill down players straight away. If you knock down a player, it can be tempting to immediately kill them. It's actually worth holding out to begin with. If you wait for a downed player to start crawling away, you can get some valuable information from them. Usually, downed players will panic and start crawling to their closest ally. You can take a look at the direction a player is crawling to find out where their friends are hiding. Just make sure to kill the player if he tries to crawl behind cover. Stay with your squad mates. If you're playing in duo or squad mode, make sure to stick with your teammates. Even if you can't communicate with them effectively, they'll still be there to provide additional firepower. If you get knocked out, your teammates may also be able to get you back up and that'll get you back into the game. If you run around on your own, you won't have these advantages. Use weapons relevant to your situation. The weapon you use should be relevant to the situation you're in. For example, if you're inside a building, consider using an SMG or a shotgun. If you're outside, make sure to use an assault rifle. In PUBG Mobile, you'll find that it's usually easier to go for weapons. That can be as forgiving as possible if you miss. For this reason, we'd recommend always using an assault rifle. Unless you're in a super close quarter situation. Take your time with long distance shots. If you're trying to take down a player from a long distance, you'll be rewarded by pacing your shots. Change your fire rate to semi and fire slower shots, it'll be far easier to hit and. You'll only need 3 to 4 body shots or 2 to 3 headshots to knock down a player. Use auto run to give your hands a break. If you need to run a long distance, hold and move the on-screen thumbstick directly upwards to activate auto run. With auto run turned on, you no longer have to push down on the W key. You only need to use your mouse to move your character around any rocks or obstacles in their path. 